Okay. Good cut. Oh sh yeah. Miles, Miles, it's bigger fish to fry, Miles. They're gonna need assistance, man. -Man I need your help. Let go, bro. Let go. You gotta let him go. Oh, god dang. way to do it baby that's one way to do it first responders are on site now at least police are still fishing but there's no sign of them any luck up river? Nothing but debris. <laughs> Who are those guys? Whoever they are, they're packing some serious tech. And now they got all that, plus Scorpion and Lee. Hey, whatever they're planning, we'll find them. We'll stop them. Yeah. Pete. When I saw Lee inside that ship, my powers, they... You think his energy got entangled with yours? I don't know, man. But it feels volatile. Well, wherever Electric Blue came from, it saved the day back there. Hey. We'll put Lee back where he belongs. Don't leave me hanging. <laughs> Found a soak over here. Not on my watch. Come on. You know you want to. <laughs> You're too much, man. Palpatine Lightning, baby. Let's go. All right. User of Madeline W24. <laughs> I don't need to see the user, but cool. Hey, Mars. Get used to hearing that voice, man. Dropped you a pin. Wanna come through? Hey, I'm Blair. What? Too busy to visit your fam? Nah, I was just giving you space after you got out. Don't need it. Besides, we gotta settle some things. We do? See you soon, kid. Just go see him and get it over with, Mouse. Then we focus on whoever took Lee and Scorpion. Something tells me they're planning something big. Yeah, something. All right, let's go do this. Party time. Uh, 
Spider-Man, Spider-Man, gonna go see Uncle Aaron, cause he's cool, and he's on, so ho ho, I'm fucking boss, he's who, for sure fucking cool. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, I got my uh, powers again. Do -ba -do, do -ba -do, do -ba -do. Oh, oh, the Dana Cast is back. Hell yeah. Dennis, you a real one for that. Swing around at the speed of sound, cause I'm a spy on Matt, and that's who I am. Ba -ba -ba. Going to see Uncle Aaron Cause he's like a second parrot Do 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 Busting out in freaky rhymes all the time I don't know what the fuck I'm saying anymore but I'm doing it Let's get it Get it, got it, good Good in the neighborhood Tell you hot And skadoosh. We really gotta do this with the mask on. Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. <laughs> Your dad used to give me that exact same look. Martin Lee. Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. <laughs> But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I call. Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Rocks on, yeah, Dewey. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Behind us. You getting some? <laughs> How did you? And Miles, that Lee business? Don't be stupid. <laughs> Easy said and done. I'm serious, Miles. I've heard this dude can turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on with you? How school? College? Anyone you like? <laughs> I don't know. So there is someone. <laughs> I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. <laughs> Lab. 
last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Don't cheat. Take your time. Done. Not bad, kid. What, what, what? Oh. Oop. Another gate. Sweet. Bada bing, bada boom. Can't pull it open from down here. All right. And there we go. You would have made a decent prowler. You should be seeing how to get inside now. All right, what do we got here? Hmm. Got it. You want to finally tell me what this is? All suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. Oh, can upgrade my health, huh? Oh yeah. Oh, using a rare tech bar. Okay. I respect the hustle. Listen, this isn't the only stash. Unk. Whoever freed Lee sounds like my tech is right up their alley. I want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay, I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Don't be a stranger. Wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oye, Miles, me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con. Está bien. Sí, Ma. Todo bien. Estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah, y cómo está él? Está trotando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Let's head out to the city. See what's going on. Maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. <laughs> yeah, okay, bud. You're just gonna find him. That truck's in trouble. <laughs> Hello, friend. No, but I can't beat the shit out of you. Uh, actually, no, I can't stop you as well. That's part of the beating the shit out of you process, really. Oop. Oh, I found him. But he just... There you go. Know that the bags banks use don't have big dollar signs on them. <laughs> I know I was disappointed. <sighs> what a shame. Miles, up there, remember you on your way? Oh, right, yes, today. <sighs> yeah, I knew that. Mr. Atlas is confirmed <clears throat> to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state, and I heard he's talking scholarships. I have so many questions for him. Be there soon. All right, let's ride. Where is this joint? I'm just fine. I used to goddamn map. I don't want to use the goddamn map, but I used to goddamn map. Put a little marky mark there and perfecto. Spider Man, Spider Man, swinging through Brooklyn, cause I'm cool. And I'm fast. Another Gonna day, get the Fortnite battle pass. Oh yeah, I'm Spider-Man. In what should have been a routine prison transfer. Oh shut the up, Jameson. The need to inject themselves into a situation that was already being handled by the proper authorities and completely botched it. A new group of mercenaries made their presence known in the hijacking of the supervillain Scorpion and Mr. Negative. Not much is known about this new collective, other than their penchant for animal skins. But one thing is abundantly clear. The spider did nothing to impede them. Had law enforcement been allowed to do their jobs, these criminals wouldn't be in the wind right now. Looks like we have an eyewitness calling in. Color, you're live. Hi, Jonah. Thanks for having me. 
Just want to point out that what you're saying is a total lie. Here we go. I was there on the pier. Law enforcement was completely outmatched. The Spider-Men saved countless lives and almost stopped those bow and arrow geeks, too. First, you're lucky to be alive. Second, let me ask you, just this week alone, can you guess how much property damage those vigilantes are responsible for? No, but that's not the issue here. I don't have time to get into a circuitous whataboutism argument when there are costumed criminals reducing our city to rubble on a daily basis. Think of all the shipping delays we're gonna face because of this. When you can't shave because your favorite cream is trapped in shipping hell, be sure to thank the Spider-Man. Time for the bureaucrats to do their job. We need action. And also, a word from our sponsors. <laughs> oh, Jameson. You will never fail to not be a dumbass. Or you never fail to be a dumbass. Oh, uh, damn. Backpack, 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 Mr. Backpack. There we go. Pulling the Peter, I see. Oh, damn. That's the most impressive move I've seen yet. Hey, Miles. What's up? Hey, good to see you. I can't believe Mr. Atlas is going to be here at BV. Maybe one of those scholarships has my name on it. If he likes my sound. <laughs> yeah, I mean, maybe. I was going to diss you, but then I realized music's probably the only thing other than being Spider Man that you truly really put all your focus and attention into. So, I respect Puzzle. Where's this dude? Which one of you nerds is it? Oh, hello, sir. Miles, glad you made it. Oh, hey, Mr. Sinclair. Oh, hmm. I just love seeing all this innovation in action. Oh, have you heard about the chemistry club? They're filling in while Miss Ferguson gets ready to demo the new robotics drone. She's running late. Presentation's on the main stage. Oh, yeah, I'll try to make it over there. Enjoy the show. Thanks. See you around. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm busy. I'm trying to get my sick beats to, uh, I don't know, just, just get me a college scholarship or what. Okay, I'm gonna assume that's just concessions and not. Genki! Hey, you made it. I want to talk to him about that computational physics program we got your missing person report half an hour ago what happened i just heard two words missing in person so i'm gonna say yes go ahead we'll save your seat <laughs> Gotta catch up to the principal. Maybe I can find out more. I mean, you were your, your spot. Well, I guess, yeah. Don't exactly want to hop up there like a maniac, I suppose. from her fitness tracker it's counting her steps wherever she is the students adore miss ferguson i hope she's all right please find her we'll do our best miss ferguson's missing oh, man sounds like she's still wearing her fitness tracker wonder if i could find that signal only one way to find out my man Let's see where this fitness tracker is. 
Last known location, Dawson Harbor. Beginning text-to-speech call with Haley Cooper. Miles, Mr. Atlas just got here. Oh, oh that's here. wacky. Oh, man. Gotta find Miss Ferguson first. Be there when I can. He's handing out scholarship applications right now. Right now. Can you get one for me? I'll do better than that. Send you a link. Thanks. Good luck. And hurry. And hurry. Hey yo, Miles. What's up, Genki? Can this wait? Not really. I've got Mr. Atlas here. I told him how you were missing the fair for volunteer work. And he asked for a phone call with you. Is uh Happy now a good time? Bad guy. Thanks, Genki. Now is definitely not a good time. Here he is, Mr. Atlas. I know you've got a flight to catch. Genki! Hi. Miles? Uh, yeah. Hello. You're whispering. Is now a bad time? Uh, no. I'll make it work. That's me. Great. I heard you're interested in our music technology program. So, tell me about yourself. What do you do for fun? Fun? Uh, well, I used to do music production. But it's been hard to find time lately. Genki here showed me some of your samples. Good stuff. Particularly your song called Swinging. <laughs> what was your inspiration? Uh, yeah. I was, uh, just swinging one day and thinking. Uh, the tune just kind of came to me. Interesting. And can you tell me about what's important to you in life? Being there for people when they need me. Being reliable, trustworthy. Someone people can depend on. Very interesting. And finally, why do you think you'd make a great addition to our school? I don't give up. And, uh, I care about doing the right thing. I won't let you down. Fascinating. <laughs> Fascinating. Thanks for your time. I think I've got enough here. Thanks. Uh, do you want my email so we can stay in touch, or, uh... uh that... That spider and flip. Maybe I can make it back to BB in time to meet Mr. Atlas in person. And clarify some things. He'll be sorry when we find him. Come here, friend. I just want to give you a little hug. Just let me. Just let me give you. I don't give you a hug from over here. Come here. There we are. What the fuck? You a freak. You freaky motherfucker. No, it's not. Shut up. Mosh. Well, there's only like one or two more of you motherfuckers anyway, so. Oh, All just right. one. Perfect. With those guys out of the way, let's see where that tracker signal leads. What? Oh, were these just... Okay. This signal should lead right to Miss Ferguson's fitness tracker. What fucking signal? I don't... I don't compute. I don't... What? what? Mother... Mother of yuck. Oh, okay. I just can see that there's stuff in here. Or something. If I want to find Miss Ferguson, I better follow that signal. <laughs> What? God damn signal. What is that melody? Mother of yuck. There she is. This glass looks pretty breakable. Oh, okay. This <laughs> cool combo. I got you. Are you okay? I'm fine. But who are these people? How do they know I work for Rand? Let's figure that out when we're not in the hostage situation. Time to squash a spider. He's dead, Spider-Man. He's ours! You hide. I've got these guys. My third. 
thought I would break you. Not the whiff! Oh shit. Operation involved kidnapping. How am I supposed to let that slide? Owie, you a bitch. God. Why won't you die? Thank you. Yeah, it's kind of difficult when I'm literally flying through the air like a bat out of hell, but yeah, sure, just use his weapon. Buddy, would you just... Just stay down! I want. There's more things I can throw at you, you piece of shit. Come here. That was just a distraction. There we go. Eh. How much brain damage do I need to give you before you just stay, stay down? There you go. God damn. Yeah. Anyways. I don't believe it. You took them out by yourself? It's in my job description. Ready to go? Are. You going to yep. carry me? Sure, I've carried people before. As long as I can get verbal confirmation that if I throw up on you, you won't sue me. <sighs> Consider this confirmation. Just try to tell a brother first. <laughs> Thanks to Spider Man. Our treasured teacher, Miss Ferguson, is back with us safe and sound. To show our gratitude, it is my honor to declare Spider-Man the official hero of Brooklyn Visions. You are always welcome here, Spider-Man. Thank you. And now, back to the Quan. We've got a robotics demonstration to do. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> it certainly went. Not much time. Hi, Miles. I appreciate your dedication to interviewing, but I could tell you were clearly busy with something important. Mr. Sinclair put in an excellent word for you, as did Principal Evans. So let's do this right and meet this week on campus. Oh, thank God. We didn't completely fuck it up. Hell yeah. Got a few app requests popping up on BV's campus. Thought I'd call you directly. Having better luck than me. I doubt it. Uh oh, I guess we're about to find out. <laughs> you show off, son of a bitch. Pete, you ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. <laughs> oh, gotta grab this call from MJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest-looking guy. Interesting. 
I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. One can only hope. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, swinging through Chinatown once again. Gonna save the day by helping Harry play fun video games like this one, but not quite nearly as fun. He was sick, now he's good. Now I'm swinging through his neighborhood. Do do, I'm fucking Spider Man. Oh, big place. Big place, Jesus Christ. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. was a startup yeah I was hoping for something a little less this but my dad was the one who you know he made all the arrangements Peter and... Parker <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think hell of a place my man it's a far cry from that chop shop that auto had you in <laughs> yeah and now that you're on board this place is really gonna start cooking. God damn. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh, really? But <laughs> I was gonna give him a tour, let him decide for himself. All right. You know, Seeing you boys together again. Right then. <laughs> Have fun. Aww. Norman. What's that about your soul showing? Ugh. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is. Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Mmm. Trying to save the bees. A noble effort. Yes, Chief. I just checked in on Anthony Hutton. I was not constantly with the AI learning we did during the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? Hell yeah. You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant problem. The, the carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Wanna see how? Whoa, this is cool! These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wolves. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away. Bam, bam, bam. Bam. Oh, nice! Yes! 
Oh, it's like a video game. Yep. Wait a minute. Oh yeah. I'm playing the video game in the video game. God Gotta damn. Gotta protect the hive. Yeah, nice. yeah. Gotta protect the hive. Gotta protect our bee friends. Gotcha. They give us food and are also fuzzy sweethearts. Wow! You're done, Peter. <laughs> A very productive session. We've got great data. Okay, <clears throat> flying home. I think I'm getting the hang of this. I knew you'd be good at this. <laughs> I'm in beesness. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. <laughs> now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. Thank you. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Dr. Uh, Connor. Any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> no. Nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. Oh, so he's not the lizard, any. So that was crazy. Hey, well, now wait a minute. Everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I, I recognize this tech, you motherfuckers. You stole my revolutionary tech. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. Wonder how it ended up here. You mother yuckers. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after mm. that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. <laughs> mayhaps, mayhaps. Where did Harry go again? What was I doing? I don't remember. I got kind of sidetracked by the whole lizard thing. Uh, I know what I'm... Oh, it's just explore. Alright, let's chill. So much to see here. Where do I even start? Hmm. Good question. I saw... Eh, fine, we can check out entomology, why not? Beehives show complex group decision-making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and splits. The Emory May Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the hunting all right, all right, all right. spectra proceed Drones. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross-collaboration between the Energy Lab and the Agricultural Lab. Ultralight drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. <laughs> you could try at home here, huh? Gotta say, Petey boy, seems like you're kind of joint. Not to mention, since you're working with Harry, he'll be way more flexible on the whole 
you know. Uh, not hating you for being Spider-Man thing. Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. Really? I'll try to come back. The latest employee of the month is Clark from Facilities. Congratulations, Clark. Fishies, I like... <laughs> <laughs> I like fish. <laughs> cool fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Want to feed them? Hell yeah, yeah. I want to feed them. Japanese koi fish have well studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals, separated by cytoplasm. We're finding it very useful for eco-friendly roofing materials. Ah, so clever. May would have loved this place. I'm sure she would have. Make the world a better place one little thing at a time. Shoot. Space. Billions and millions and millions and billions ago, I was an asshole. I'm Neil deGrasse Tyson, and I'm a snob. Organic life forms have arisen from non-biological chemical compounds. Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. Hmm. Ah, space. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. Investigative stuff in the space. Whoops. You mother, sorry, you motherfuckers found the venom symbiote. It's almost too good to be true. It's because it is too good to be true. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? Gotta think this through before signing on. Man, you're so clever and smart, and the fact that you work with Harry, you get all the hours. You need slash want to schedule in the way you want. Ooh, now this is what I was intrigued by. Is this a fusion reactor? You really have a particle accelerator? Ah, particle accelerator. Yeah, proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll we'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. This whole bloody Where place is now? excellent. Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Ugh. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Rebor Mendel and the pea plants? Sure. I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Mm -hmm. Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. That's cool. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Sure yes. did. That was so great. Interesting research project. And lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. <laughs> The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm -hmm. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks the about one and you only. Frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Sure. Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. 
In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Yeah. Okay, if All I right. combine these traits. Bottling bubble. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on Jesus. for well and drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, does whatever Spider-Man can. So he says, well, eats an ass, because he likes sauerkraut. Yeah, I know that's that not the way you want to roll with the rock, but like the rock is cooking. Uh, no, you fuck you again. You need to put a bit. What? Am I just? No, oh, I just want to place those anywhere. Okay. Spider Man, Spider Man. Interesting. There we are. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Mm -hmm. Read a book on urban garden forms. It's most intriguing. We're really brought together the community, so to speak. Beautiful work, Peter. No problem, bro. No problem at all. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. God damn. I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? <laughs> Harry, now remember. The things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Today's nope, false alarm. Right here. Wow. Man. We're gonna make him tear up. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's a hell of an it's argument. Amazing. Spider-Man? one thing. 
Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> oh, one quick thing. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? <laughs> you bet. to tell you some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city if you have time check them out i've sent you the locations and your badge will grant you access all right i'll swing by <laughs> he'll swing hey, by sorry i didn't get back to you before but i was i just got a new job for real well that's awesome where's it at this new foundation run by my best friend it's it's incredible but i can fill you in later What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me. Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. <laughs> Not getting out of it this time. Guys, maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. Or they're invisible. Hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Oh, man, we were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Glittering? Come on, man. Yeah. Agreed. What in the? No, not in the water, Pete. That oh, he's fucking dead. Oh shit! <laughs> he just got arrows sticking out of him. Goddamn. Yeah, yeah, under the shield. I know. I'm just a little bit rusty. But they sent my first rodeo. Owie, you bitch. What the fuck? God damn it, Bobby. You sons of bitches. <laughs> All right. Can we just game? There we go. Thank you. 
I agree. It's where I put your body on the fucking floor. I like switching it up like that. Very convenient for me. Oh, good. Yeah. Owie! Bitch! There we are. Bada bing, bada boom. Should take a look around. Whew. Well, lads. You know what? We'll investigate this a bit first. Before I get what do to we that. have here? Hello, puppet. Maybe it'll lead me to some answers. Nope. Okay, birdie. Take me to your nest. I'm gonna miss these chases when I'm an Emily May. The adrenaline going through the city like it's an obstacle course never gets old. Getting to do real science though. For actual money. Oh my god, I finally did it! I have a stable career. <laughs> okay, cool it, Parker. We can daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Whoa! Is that a real gun? That actually works? God damn. Hope you have renter's insurance. <laughs> I'll take that. that. Yeah. <laughs> he read my mind. That's too close now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. But Scorpion is? Okay. You know, I've got nothing against Gargan. I'm just saying I've kicked his butt a few times. There we are. Now, where's your boss? I don't think they're going to have the data for that here, but we can look. Maybe I can test something out. Birdie, this is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a... Yep. Oh, is that your home? Oh, shit. Come on, Birdie, let go. Come on. Stop buy a ticket for this ride. Send this location to MJ. Maybe she can take up some building records. All right. As good as that is, I have a feeling this is going to be another long bit of the mission. So it's been about an hour. So I'm going to end it here for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you're enjoying the series so far. If you are, leave a like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, this has been really fun for me. And I can't wait to continue playing. Bye, guys.